action. Hello and welcome to Yoga Scopes. Here we have Lauren F. Hello. <laughs> We're not going to sing. Can you imagine if I sang I the entire die. flow? I think you'd turn it off right away. I would die. I'm going to make sure this is on. Keep going. We really have a yoga sculpt class today, and it's going to be fun. Okay? Why well, that, used to sing at our soccer game senior year, every, before every game. I did. Let's give them something to talk about. It was about. my main role. I was the bench warmer, but it was very no, important. Was more than that. Well, I was the singing bench warmer. <laughs> so apparently this is why I teach yoga now, right? <laughs> um, crap. We're just having a day. But anyways, don't throw your crystals. I want to explain to you and just give you some fun facts about my new crystal, citrine. So if you're looking to manifest some stuff in your life, citrine is perfect. It helps you to really just increase like your self-worth, your power, and I love it. So it's orange, just like your sacral chakra, and it's really good for money as well. So what? Get a big block of it. Get a lot of citrine. Carry it around with you. And with that being said, we're just going to actually get started at some point today. So we're going to start on your backs. Yes. So start to close your eyes and just arrive here. Letting your day go and bringing your focus between these four corners of your mat space, knowing you're exactly where you need to be. Then start to deepen your mind-body connection by deepening your breath. Take a deep breath in through your nose. Fill up your belly ribs and your chest. Open mouth, exhale. And do that again, deep, full breath in. Deep. Full breath out. One last time. Deepest breath in. Fill up. Open mouth. Exhale. Now from here, seal your lips. Breathe in and out of your nose. Tapping into your ujjayi breath to carry you through your practice today. Taking this moment to set an intention for your practice. Maybe there's something that you're focusing on, use that as your intention today. But if nothing comes to mind, I invite you to take on our intention today of the simple notion of inner knowing that you are a healer. You're your own best healer. You have everything you need inside you. When it comes down to it, we are all just love. We put up all these walls and layers and shields to block us from our true purpose, our true self, out of protection. But when we break all those layers down, it comes back to something so simple as love. And love is the best healer of all. So rather than looking for all the external factors, the jobs, the money, the relationships, the vacations, or whatever it is you're looking for on the outside, Know that whatever you need to make you the best version of you is all within you already. So take one more big breath in. Open mouth, exhale. From here, find a long body stretch. Send your arms over your head, lengthen from your fingers to your toes. And then draw your knees into your chest. Wrap your hands around your shins. Start to do some little circles here. Roll out your one low back, one direction, the other. And let this feel good. Then find some stillness in the center. Form a basket grip behind your head, elbows wide. Inhale, lift your chest. Exhale, left elbow, right knee, left leg goes long. Inhale to center and exhale, switch. Yogi bicycles, just to warm up your core a little bit. Back and forth. Take it at your own pace. Slow, fast. Keep your elbows wide. Twist in your obliques. We've got a little bit more of a leg workout today. So we're still going to activate that core here. For 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 
four, three, two, last one, lower down. Draw your shins into your chest one more time. And send your arms out like wings. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, easy spinal twist. Knees fall over to the right. You can gaze the sky over to the left. Maybe you want to take your right hand and place it on top of your left thigh. Next breath in, knees draw back to center. And exhale, just switch it out. Let your knees fall over to the left. Gaze the sky over to the right. Next breath in, knees draw back to center. Reach for the backs of your thighs and rock and roll to your neutral table here. Flat back. Let's just start to find a couple rounds of cat cow. Doing what feels good in your body. Ground down through your toes, your hands. Open your throat. Maybe you want to take your hips in circles or roll out your neck. using the next few breaths to really explore. I mean, it doesn't matter what it looks like, it just matters how it feels. Then take one final round. I'm gonna turn back to center. From here, ground down through your left hand. Inhale, right arm goes high, maybe you gaze up. Exhale, thread the needle. Right arm goes under. Right shoulder and cheek rest on your mat. Stay here, walk your left fingertips out. Or maybe you want to go for a half bind, wrapping your left hand behind your low back, or option two, your left leg. Wherever you are, take one more full round of breath. Start to open up through your right shoulder. And then start to make your way out. Left hand plants, inhale, right arm high. Exhale, back to your table. We'll switch it out. Plant your right hand, inhale, left arm high. Exhale, thread the needle. Take any variation you wish here. Maybe you walk your fingertips out, half bind, or add in the core strength. One more full round of breath. Then your right hand plants under your shoulder. Inhale, left arm high. Exhale, back to your table. Right leg extends back behind you, then your left. You're in your high plank. Push the earth away. Puff up that space between your shoulders. Lengthen from your heels to the crown of your head. For three, two, last one. Deep breath in. Exhale, low push up. Elbows 90 degrees. Option to lower to your knees. We're going to do four more. Inhale high. Exhale low. Three more. Last two. Last one, hold in your high plank, deep, full breath in. Exhale, slow and control lower all the way down to your mat. Untuck your toes, palms underneath your shoulders. Inhale, baby cobra, lift your chest. Maybe you want to have your hands. Deep breath in. Exhale, lower. Walk your palms back by your upper ribs. Inhale, lengthen your arms. Pull your heart through. Exhale. Tuck your toes, hips up and back. Down dog. Deep, full breath in. Deep, full breath out. Shift your gaze to your hands and slow and control. Walk your feet up to meet your hands, landing hips with distance apart so you can fit your two fists hanging out here in your ragdoll pose. Stay in stillness or raw. And start to release a grip if you have it. Heel toe your feet to touch. Inhale, slowly roll up one vertebra at a time. Arms sweep high. Exhale, hands to heart center. And close your eyes for a moment. I'm going to stay in. Knowing you are your own best healer with one breath together. So take a full deep breath in. Open mouth, exhale. All right, open your eyes, inhale, arms sweep high. Exhale, swan dive, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen your spine. Exhale, hand plant. Step or float back, your high to low push up. Inhale, up dog. 
exhale. Down dog, we're gonna flow that two more times through and then we got our first round of sculpt. Mm -hmm. Inhale, bend your knees, look forward. Exhale, step or float, front of your mat. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, arms sweep high. Exhale, hands. Inhale, arms high. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, hands plant your high to low. Exhale, all the way to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale. Down dog. Notice your breath and your body connecting a little bit more as we do that one more time. Inhale, bend your knees, look forward. Exhale, step or float to the front. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, arms sweep high. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, arms high. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, your high to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale. Down dog, deep, full breath in. Deep, full breath out. Sigh it out. Inhale, bend your knees, look forward. Exhale, step or float, front of your mat. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, arms sweep high. Exhale, hands to your heart. Okay, we're going in to our sculpt here. Ready to have some fun? So 30 seconds here. You're gonna step your left foot back. We got a lunge, pivot open to your goddess. Ready, go. Lunge, goddess, lunge. Back and forth, this is all body weight here. Don't worry, we're gonna burn this out. 15 seconds left. Then we're going to our second move. Ten, last 10. For three, two, last one, turn to the front, stay on this leg. Two pulses in your lunge, drive your knee to your chest. Two pulses, knee to chest. If it's too much, you can just step your feet to touch. Should have mentioned that first, right? But I know you guys got it in you. Two pulses, knee to chest, drive it in. Really squeeze those glutes. We got five seconds left here. Burn. Yes, it is. We're going into a little cardio. We're staying on this leg. Three, two, last one. Right hand back behind you, left arm high. Drive it up. Send it back. Drive. My leg is burning. So bad. Right? We're on. Who knew body weight? If it gets too much, modify. You can step and ditch the jump. 15 seconds. Can you jump high? I'm kind of stuck. <laughs> Let's pick it up, guys. Get your heart rate up. Three, two, last one. All right, we got a pop squat. Heels in, toes out. Squat it low. Squeeze your inner thighs. Drive to touch. A little more cardio here. Squat, touch. So these, we got four moves. You got about 20 seconds left here. Then we're taking it all on the other side. And that is the rounds. Three rounds total. 10 seconds. I hear a lot of breathing. I'm breathing two, three, two, last one, right foot steps back, lunge, turn, pivot, goddess, hands to your heart or to your hips, lunge, goddess, my leg is still burning, quad on fire, quad is on fire, yes, all these moves, you don't need anything to get a good workout. You just need your body, right? We just need ourselves. We're our own best freaking healers. <laughs> For three, two, last one, turn and pivot. Two pulses in your lunge. Knee to your chest or feet to touch. Getting in a little balance. Burning out your left glute, left quad. All of it. 15 seconds here. And we got those two little cardio moves coming up. Last minute of work here for three, two, last one, left arm back, right arm high. Drive your knee to your chest. Add a little jump or you can skip the jump. I'm starting to sweat. Yep. 20 seconds left. Well, less than 20, about 15 now. Drive it up. Five, 
five seconds. We got this. We never give up here. Last run. Heels in, toes out. Pop it low. Drive it to legs to touch. Squeeze your inner thighs. Hips low. If it gets too much, you can take air squats too. Heels in, toes out. We have 10 seconds left. First round is done after this. Woohoo! Woo that is right. Five, four, three, two. Last one. Okay. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. What'd you think? Fantastic. Cool. Okay. On fire. Yes, mine too. We only gotta do that two more times though. Inhale, arms high. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, hands plant your high to low push up. Inhale, up dog. Exhale. Down dog, deep full breath in. Deep full breath out. Inhale like a wave, ripple forward to your high plank. Deep breath in. Exhale, knees lower. Okay, this is where it gets fun. So you're going to lift and extend your right leg back behind you. Dial your right pinky toe down, engage your core. Deep breath in, exhale. Draw your knee into your nose, crunch it in. Step your foot between your hands. We rise up to one-legged Tadasana here. Rise up, hold. Okay, find the balance, catch your gaze. I'm gonna take you through how we're gonna flow this. Deep breath in, exhale. Hands plant, lower your left knee down, back to your table, send your right leg back behind you. Got it? Got it. Got it, good. Okay, two more times, a little faster. Deep breath in, exhale, knee to nose. Foot between your hands, rise up, step it back, left knee lowers, right leg back, knee to nose, step it through, rise up, step it back, lower your knee down, right leg extends and hold. Deep breath in, exhale, draw your knee to your nose, crunch it in, step your foot between your hands, tuck your back toes, lift your back knee, scissor your inner thighs, tense your fingers, inhale, hover your back knee, gaze up. Exhale, straighten through your front leg and fold. You can ground down through your front foot or lift and flex. Right hip back, left hip forward. Inhale, lengthen. And exhale, fold. Take one more full round of breath here. And ground down through your front foot. Bend into your front knee. Inhale, arms high, crescent lunge. Right hip back, left hip forward. You're gonna ball your back foot. Maybe a slight bend in your back knee, ground down through your feet. Deep breath in, exhale, open up warrior two. Back foot 90 degrees, arms to the horizon, torso in line with your hips. Inhale, flip your front palm, reverse. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, hands through your heart, bend into your back knee, straighten through your front leg. Skandasana, hands to your heart or to the earth. Front foot lift in and flex or grounded 90 degrees. Breathe into your hips. Take one more big breath in. Exhale. Turn and pivot to the front ball of your back foot. Hands around your front foot. Left hand plants. Inhale, right arm high. Inhale, lengthen. And exhale, twist. Take one more big breath in. Exhale, top hand plants. Step back. Your high to low push up. Inhale, up dog. Exhale. Down dog, deep breath in, deep breath out. We'll take that on the other side. Inhale, high plank for three, two, last one, deep breath in. Exhale, knees lower. Send your left leg back behind you. In the balance here, left pinky toes dial down, engage your core. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, crunch it in, knee to nose. Step your foot between your hands, ground down through it. Rise up. One leg Tadasana. Taking this on the other side, just noticing balance may be a little different. We're gonna have some fun with this, something a little different to add in. And deep breath in, exhale, hands plant, lower your right knee, extend your left leg back behind you. Okay, we'll flow that two more times through, a little bit faster, deep breath in, exhale, knee to nose. Step your foot through, 
rise up, step it back, hands plant, right knee lowers, left leg extends, knee to nose, foot between your hands, rise up, step back, extend. I lost count. Do we do that one more time? We're good. We're good. I thought so. All right, deep breath in. This is why we have two of us sometimes. <laughs> Exhale, knee to nose. Step your foot between your hands, tuck your back toes, lift your back knee, scissor your inner thighs. Inhale, heavy your back knee, gaze up. Exhale, extended pyramid straighten through your front leg. Front foot lifted or grounded. Left hip back, right hip forward. Inhale, lengthen. And exhale, fold. One more round of breath. Ground down through your front foot, bend into your front knee, inhale, arms high, crescent lunge. Left hip back, right hip forward, ground down through your feet. Deep breath in. Exhale, warrior two. Settle, breathe. Using this moment in time to connect. Connect back with yourself here. Inhale, flip your front palm, reverse. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, skandasana, back of your mat. Hands to your heart or to the earth. Send your breath to your inner hips, wherever you feel it the most. That's always where I feel it. Take one more full round of breath. Deep breath in. Exhale, turn and pivot to the front right hand plants. Inhale, left arm high. Lengthen from your tailbone to the crown of your head. Lift through your back quad. Deep breath in. Exhale, top hand plant. Step back your high to low push up. Inhale, up dog. Exhale. Down dog, deep breath in. Deep breath out. All right, we're gonna do that breath to movement one time through. We're going into second round of sculpt after that. Ooh. Ready? Here we go. Inhale, high plank. Exhale, knee lowers. Inhale, right leg extends back behind you. Exhale, knee to nose. Rise on up, deep breath in. Exhale, step it back, lower your left knee. Inhale, right leg extends. Exhale, knee to nose and crunch. Step your foot between your hands, tuck your back toes, lift your back knee, inhale, hover your back knee. I said we're doing it once. <laughs> Probably didn't get good instructions there. <laughs> hover your back knee, gaze up. Exhale, extended pyramid. Inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, skandasana. Deep breath in. Exhale, turn and pivot to the front left hand plants. Inhale, right arm high, twist it out. Deep breath in. Exhale, top hand lower, step it back. High to low push up. Inhale, up dog. Exhale. Down dog, inhale, high plank. Exhale, knees lower. Inhale, left leg extends back behind you. Exhale, knee to nose, step it through. Deep breath and rise up just one time here. Exhale, step it back, lower your right knee. Inhale, left leg back. Exhale, crunch, knee to nose and hold. Step your foot between your hands, tuck your back toe, lift your back knee. Inhale, dip into your back knee, gaze up. Exhale, extended pyramid. Inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, skandasana. Deep breath in. Exhale, turn and twist to the front. Right hand plants, inhale, left arm high. Exhale, top hand plants. Step it back, you are high to low push up. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog, deep breath in, deep breath out. Inhale, bend your knees, look forward. Exhale, step or float, front of your mat. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, fold. Inhale, rise up, exhale. Hands to your heart or to your hips. Left foot steps back, three, two, one, go. <laughs> lunge, goddess, lunge, goddess. I'm full of voices and personalities today. <laughs> I'm singing, drill sergeanting, I don't know. Being our best self. It's 
all it's about, right? We got about 10 seconds left here. Three, two, last one. Turn to the front, two pulses. Drive your knee into your chest. Two pulses or we step feet to touch. Squeeze your glutes. Find your focus here. Burning it out. 15 seconds left. Deep breaths in. Deep breaths out. Three, two. Last one. Step it back. Right hand back. Left hand forward. Jump or knee to chest. You choose here. Let's get our heart rate up. Start to burn it out. Sweat it out. Surpass those beliefs you got in your head. That's what Lauren always says, right? You got to get through the blocks. 15 seconds left. By Lauren, I mean that Lauren. I'm not referring myself to the third person here. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, last one. Pop squats, heels and toes out. Squat low, drive it in. Let your heels click. Well, maybe not like hurt them, but. Okay, 20 seconds left. Burning it out. We got less than 10. We're going right into the other side. Lunge, goddess, right foot steps back. Three, two, last one. Lunge, turn, pivot, heels and toes out, sink it low. Whew. This is where I feel to burn the most, I think. Second side. Yep. Right quad. Still on fire. <laughs> yep. Luckily, we only got one more round after this. Oh, yeah. Flies by. One more flow, one more round. But first, we're going to be in the moment and finish this one. Three, two, last one. Face the front, two pulses, knee to chest. Keep this going here. Fifteen seconds left. Should be breathing, should be sweating. Three, two, last one. Step it back, right in two. Those jump lunges, or you can skip the jump. 20 seconds left here. Let's go. Let's go is right. I'm feeling the burn. Yeah. I've said that like 10 times, but I really truly am. <laughs> 10 seconds. That's so real. It is so real. Hurt so good. Three, two, last one. All right, pop squats. Low to touch. Lift your chest, sink your hips low. Let's do it. We are almost done with this round. You got 20 seconds left here. Okay, last five, four, three, two, last one. Okay. Who is right? Grab some water. Okay, we're going to add on to that sequence a little bit. Finish up with one more round. Call it a day. Inhale, arms high. Exhale, sit into your Turn to let your heart rate slow down while we build some strength. Send your hips back, live through your heart. For three, two, you sink just a little bit lower. One more, sink a little bit lower. Deep breath in. Exhale, hands through your heart, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, hands plant, step or fold back. Your high to low push up. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale like a wave. Come through your high plank. Deep breath in. Exhale, knees lower. Inhale, extend your right leg back. Exhale, crunch it in, knee to nose. Step your foot between your hands. 
rise up, step it back, lower your knee down, right leg extends two more times, step it through, rise up, step it back, right leg extends, knee to nose, step through, one leg to dasana, hold. Find the balance, find a point of non-movement, deep breath in, exhale, hands through your heart or to the ground, warrior three. Sweep your left leg back, left pinky toes dial down here. Find the stillness, deep breath in, exhale, land on the ball of your back foot. Inhale, arms sweep high, crescent. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, extended side angle. Form to your thigh, top hand to the sky, maybe bicep by your ear. Wrap your top shoulder back, engage your pelvic floor, ground down through your feet. Inhale, star pose, heels and toes out. Exhale, wide legged forward fold, switch your feet. You can grab for your big toes or outsides of your feet. Maybe you wanna reach for the back of your mat. Release and let go here. Take two more big breaths. And start to walk your palms underneath your shoulders. Deep breath in. Exhale, scan it off to the back. Hands to your heart or to the earth. Deep full breath in. Exhale, turn and pivot to the front left hand plants. Inhale, right arm high. Stay here, step back for your side plank. Stag your feet, stack them, or lower to your bottom knee. Take one more big breath in. Exhale, plant your top hand, your high to low push up. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog, deep breath in. Deep breath out. Okay guys, last side. So exciting, right? Yes. <laughs> Inhale, high plank. Exhale, knees lower. All right, extend your left leg back behind you. Deep breath in. Exhale, knee to nose. Step your foot between your hands. Rise up, one leg Tadasana. Two more times, we'll land in one leg Tadasana. Step back, lower your knee down. Left leg extends. Knee to nose, crunch. Foot between your hands. Rise up. Step back, hands plant, left leg extends, knee to nose, flip between your hands, rise up and hold. Find the balance, engage your core. Deep breath in, exhale, warrior three. Hands to your heart or to the earth, dial your right pinky toe down. Find this moment in stillness here. Deep breaths in and deep breaths out. Take one more big breath in. Exhale in on the ball of your back foot. Inhale, arms sweep high, crescent. Take one more big breath in. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, extended side angle. Form to your thigh for support. Maybe you wanna open your arms, top hand to the sky or bicep by your ear. Feel a nice side body stretch, building some core strength, strengthen your legs. So you open through your side body and your heart. One more full round of breaths. Next breath in, star pose, heels in, toes out, squeeze your glutes. Exhale, wide legged forward fold, switch. Toes in, heels out. Letting all that blood flow to your head, releasing any tension. And reminding yourself, no one is perfect. We're all meant to have our flaws. And yoga teaches us to just breathe and move, connect, just get out of our head. Take one more full round of breath. So to walk your hands underneath your shoulders, deep breath in. Exhale, bend into your back knee, straighten through your front leg, hands to your heart or to the earth. Deep, full breath in. Exhale, turn and pivot to the front, twist it out, ball your back foot, right hand plants, left arm high. Stay here or set up for your side plank. Four, three, 
two. Last one, deep breath in. Exhale, top hand plants, your high to low push up. Inhale, up dog. Exhale. Down dog, deep full breath in. Deep full breath out. All right, last round. Inhale, bend your knees, look forward. Exhale, step or float to the front. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, arms sweep high. Exhale, hands to your heart or to your hips. Left foot steps back. Lunge, turn, pivot to your goddess. Lunge, goddess. Burning it out here. You falling over? I am. It's balance challenge too. First two are a little more strength. Second two, get your heart rate up. But we're building strength and stamina this entire time here. We got 10 seconds left. For three, two, last one. Turn to the front, double pulse, lunge, knee to chest. You can have your hands kind of wherever it feels good. On the lunge or the lift, I always send them back. Just kind of what my body wants to do. 15 seconds left. Less than 10, then we have those lunge jumps coming up. Three, two, last one. Okay. I'm scared. You're scared? What do you Ooh. mean? You don't want to do it? Yeah. <laughs> the anticipation yeah. is the killer. When you don't want to do it, it means you got to do it more. Come on, Law, we got this. Woo. 15 seconds. We all have fears, right? Sometimes pressing play on these videos may be one of yours. <laughs> but you get stronger mentally and physically every time you show up. So let's do it. Last one. Pop squats, heels in, toes out. Don't wait. Just get started right away. 20 seconds left. Last 10. We're going into the other side. Two minutes of work, that's it. Three, two, last Ooh. one. Right foot steps back. Lunge, goddess. Lunge, slow it down, goddess. Make this focused. Whew. I hope you feel this tomorrow. It feels right now. <laughs> I know that's never a good sign, right? It's good when I make Lauren feel something. It doesn't happen all the time. I love it. Three, two, last one, turn to the front. Two pulses, knee to chest. Twenty seconds left. The anticipation is coming, right? <laughs> done, done, done. <laughs> this is probably my favorite move of all of them. This one right here? Yeah. Same. Three, two, last one. Step it back. Jump it on up. See how high you can get. It's okay if it's not very high. We're just getting up straight up. We're just getting through this here. And this one's probably like my least favorite. Woo. 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 All right, I'm like a sign of death here. We got less than 10, five, four, three, two. Last one, step it forward, pop squats, last 30 seconds. We got this, guys. Who said you need an hour of leg day, right, to burn them out? So it's 12 minutes of work. That's literally it. Five seconds left. Woo! Two. Last one. All right. Awesome job. Awesome job, La. Great work. Great work to you, too. We're going to stretch out those legs. Inhale, arms high. Exhale. Hindi squat, sink it low. A little bit of a balance challenge here. Deep breath in, exhale. 
Lower it down, find your seat. Left leg extends, right leg, foot to your inner thigh. Inhale, arms high. Exhale, turn and pivot over your left leg. Maybe you want to take your right hand outside of your left foot. You can grab for your ankle or your shin. Let your breath slow down. Take one more round of breath. And start to rise on up. Soles your feet to touch, knees out wide, tall spine. Stay here, start to fold forward. You can adjust if you need a little more, send your heels back towards your glutes a little bit. If it's too much, you can extend your legs out farther from you. Maybe you want to add in a little flutter. You can play around and see what works for you. And start to rise up, find a tall spine. Right leg extends, left sole your foot inside, deep breath in. Exhale, turn, pivot, and fold. Really starting to release, let your breath slow down. Shift gears, shifting modes. One more round of breath. Rise on up. In front of you. Inhale, arms sweep high. Exhale, fold forward. Maybe you want to take a slight bend in your knees. Inhale, lengthen. And exhale, fold. Inhale, core strength brings you up and then lowers you all the way down. Setting up for your figure four. Right ankle, left thigh. Left foot plants to the earth. If you want to lift your left foot off the earth, go for it. Grab, grab for the back of your thigh or your left shin. Right foot's flexed. Glutes may be a little sore tomorrow. <laughs> so I suggest doing this stretch again or a half pigeon or... We need to build the strength and stretch it out. It's all important. Take one more round of breath and send your arms out like wings. Keep your feet and your legs where they are. Deep breath in. Exhale, twist over to the left. Left foot plants. Option to grab for your left ankle with your right ankle with your left hand or place your hand inside of your thigh and gently guide it away. Twist, hip stretch, or wherever else you may feel it. Next breath in, return back to center. Just switch it out. Figure four, opposite side. Just noticing where you may feel the sensations on this side of your body. Imagine sending your breath those areas that need a little more love. Imagine sending your breath there to heal it, to heal you. There's so much power in your breath. Take one more full deep breath in. Full exhale. And send your arms out like wings. Deep breath in. Exhale, twist over to And do whatever feels good, or maybe you gaze over to the left. Next breath in, return back to center. And take any final movements or poses your body may be asking for before making your way to complete stillness. Maybe it's a back bend or happy baby or legs up the wall. Or maybe you're ready to make your way down to your mat and settle in. Reminding yourself that you can always pause these videos to extend and stay as long as you wish. And when you find that place to lay and rest, close your eyes and take a deep, full breath in. Fill up to the top crown of your head and hold it. 
open mouth exhale. Shavasana. Using these next few moments to just be here. And I'll guide you out when the time has come. You are a healer. The healing you give to the world can happen as gracefully and naturally as the pine trees touch and heal with their life, their presence. Arousing your senses, they fill you with their fragrance. Their presence changes your energy, calms your fears, lets you know all is well. You know you can stand tall, joyfully be who you are and grow where you are. You have the ability to touch those around you in a way that heals them without hurting or draining you. One of your gifts to yourself and to the world is that of a healer. You don't have to force it, strive to make it happen. It happens gently and naturally when you love and accept who you are. Open to your healing powers, your ability to heal yourself and those around you. Receive this gift with joy, share it freely with all you meet. Open your healing powers and you will cherish your past, all you have gone through and done. Who you are is love. What love does is heal. Start to deepen your breath. Bring awareness back to your physical body. Maybe you take gentle movements with your fingers and your toes, or roll your ankles and wrists in circles, or take your head side to side. And then extend your arms over your head. Find a full body stretch. Rolling over to either side for your fetal pose. This place that signifies rebirth, renewal. And just taking this moment in time to remind yourself, everything you need is within you. You are so much love, you have so many gifts, and know that your unique powers have the power to heal yourself and all those around you when you take care of yourself. Use your top hand to guide you up to a comfortable seat. Keep your eyes closed and draw your hands to prayer at heart center. We'll close practice today with one breath together. So take a full deep breath in. Open mouth, exhale. Draw your thumbs to your third eye center. So we bow forward and say namaste. Namaste. Namaste, everybody. Thank you so much for practicing with us today. We hope you enjoyed this sculpt. Hopefully you got a little burn, a little stretch, and you can let us know if you feel it tomorrow. Yes, how you, the stairs feel tomorrow. Right? I hope it kind of hurts a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> That's the goal, okay, right? Yay. Also, if you're looking, reminder, this is the citrine crystal. If you want it up close and personal here. Questions on this, let me know. Healing powers. Bam.